City Hall has released its blueprint for Brisbane over the next 20 years and Jesse Grayson found the draft plan already attracting plenty of critics. It's Brisbane 20 years from now. We'll see 156,000 new houses, wider footpaths and homes will be built a metre higher. Also on the rise, building in the suburbs. High density zoning is coming. Take up a Mount Gravatt, Indrapilly, Tawong, Carindale, some of those places where we've already had engagements with people. And there's more. Alderley, Inogra, Carina, Holland Park. For the first time ever, they, those suburbs will be hit with massive increase in densities. Graham Quirk says residents affected by the high density zoning changes will have plenty of time to air their grievances and try and change council's mind. But groups who've already been through the process say the meetings are nothing more than a waste of time. Paul Paulos says high density in Mitchelton is already a disaster. Developers built no car parks and that's clogging suburban streets. They will not listen to those people in those suburbs. They will make out they're listening to them, but they will keep you quiet. The Lord Mayor says no new roads are planned just yet. They'll be built and upgraded as required. Tunnels and tolls appear on the outer. We're not looking at any toll projects into the future. What we have is a series of projects now which will be localised projects. Council will debate the future plan for nine days. Final approval rests with the State Government. Jesse Grayson, 10 News.